everyone and welcome to my new doll repaint video well guys today we're going to make the new wednesday adams doll and yes i remember i've just made another wednesday doll it wasn't that long ago but it was two or three months ago probably but i've made my first wednesday doll before i watched the new netflix show with jenna ortega and you know i really love this show so much the new netflix version of wednesday that i felt extremely tempted to make the new version of this character as well and then I ask you guys to give me some ideas of some beautiful dresses or characters that you would love to see it was in my first video of this year I think and many of you suggested me making uh, the new Wednesday in her beautiful black dress you know from the TikTok dance like this version of Wednesday and then I thought you know if we both want the same if I want to make the new Wednesday and you want to see the new Wednesday then let's make Make the new Wednesday. I was first thinking about wait until the second season of the show but why should we wait let's make her now so I asked my mom to make the dress for my new Wednesday the iconic black dress from the TikTok challenge uh, this dress has already arrived this time it didn't stuck in transit it arrived really quite quickly so the dress is already here and I can start working on my doll so let's start this transformation but of course guys please don't forget to subscribe to my channel hit the bell button to get notified about my new doll repaint videos and of course please support my art here on YouTube with your like and this being said, let's start working. I've decided to use this Monster High doll for my makeover. Well, first of all, because of the smaller body that this doll has. She's a teenager, the same as Wednesday. So I thought this doll would fit better than a regular size Monster High. And the second reason why I've chosen this doll is, of course, her hands. She has these claws, so she can definitely kind of dance, dance, dance with her hands, hands, hands like this. So I'm very happy about this choice. Now let's remove her outfit. Let's cut her hair off, disconnect the head from the body and then I will wipe her face off with pure acetone. gone and I still want to cut off her wolf ears because Wednesday doesn't really need them and then the holes in her head I will cover up with patches made out of warbler thermoplastic. And after this, 
I can seal her face with a couple of layers of Mr. Super Clear sealant and then I can start drawing her new face using soft pastels and watercolor pencils. And my goal for today is to make her more pale, more grim looking, with dark eyes and with quite contrast lips. Okay, this is where I'm going to stop working on her face and now it's time to blush her body to make it the same color like the face. Great, the face and the body look really good, this part has been finished and now I think I want to work on her hair. I will use black yarn to make it and I'm going to start with turning this acrylic yarn into hair.
I'm going to glue this hair to the doll's head. Okay, this is what I've got two days later when all this glue got dry and now I'm going to style her hair. I will make her braids first and then I will cut and style her bangs. This is where I've ended up with her hair. I think it looks really cute. She can wear her braids down in a more kind of casual way or you can connect them together on the back or on top of her head to make it look more like in the dance scene from the movie. Okay, the hair is finished and now let's move on to her outfit and accessories. And first of all, let's take a look at the dress that my mom made. And I think that this dress looks exactly like in the movie. Absolutely beautiful. Such a perfect dress. I'm totally in love with it. I don't know, it's so pretty, beautiful, absolutely. And my mom has also made underwear for her because this dress is quite see-through and a tiny belt and also a pair of stockings. So this is an absolutely beautiful outfit and I think it will look really pretty on the doll. And now I still need to make a pair of boots to complete this look and Wednesday wears these beautiful massive Prada boots. Here they are for sale for $950. I really love this type of boots, a mix of something classic with something edgy, really beautiful boots. So I will make them for my doll with great pleasure today. And first of all I need to make a pattern.
I've cut out all the details out of Warbo Thermoplastic and now I will start connecting them together. what I've made guys check it out I think my boots look absolutely beautiful but now I still need to paint them to make them more kind of black and shiny and more finished my finished Prada boots and you know guys I feel really proud of them such a beautiful pair of boots I'm very happy now I can put on her outfit the shoes and then I will make some extras for my Wednesday Okay, first of all, I want to make the thing and I'm going to make him out of this single male doll hand Don't ask me where this hand is coming from. It's a mystery really So I'm going to start with modifying the wrist area of this hand to make it more believable
Yep, it looks really good to me. The only problem is that this thing cannot stand on its own. It can just lay on the ground. So I've decided to attach a pin to the back to make it more stable. Well, I've ended up actually attaching two pins, but now my thing is very steady and you cannot really see those pins when you look at it from the front. Great, I'm very happy about it. And now let's paint it. finished thing guys check it out I think it looks really great I'm really happy I've decided to make it it's beautiful and terrifying at the same time so it's exactly like it should be and now I still want to make the Wednesday's iconic black cello like the last detail of this project today I really love this black cello I think it's a great detail for Wednesday for this character so and I've decided to 3d print it using my new 3d printer because it has a bigger printing surface and hopefully my cello will be big enough for the small monster high doll You can see the beautiful pink cello that I've got. I think it looks really beautiful. Now I just need to wash it, cure it, and then I will sand the back of it a little bit to get rid of the bumps and holes caused by these supports. And it looks already so good, I don't know, I'm really excited about this cello. So now let's attach the pin to the bottom of it and I will make it out of a toothpick. And then I will paint my cello black.
Wow, it looks really amazing. I'm really super excited about this black cello saying it again. So, but now we still have to attach the strings and then we're still missing a cello bow. So I'm going to make it quickly. So now both the cello and the bow look amazing to me and it means we can take a look at the end result pictures. So guys, this is my finished Wednesday Adams doll and I'm so happy that I've decided to make the second Wednesday on my channel because she's completely different from my first doll and I think she's absolutely epic. I try to recreate all her special features and I think she looks just fantastic in this phenomenal dress, in her super cool boots, the thing is nearby running around and she always can play her cello if she feels like it. So I'm really happy about this project and about all the details. So I hope you were not bored getting two Wednesday dolls in a row approximately in a very short period of time. I hope it was a fun project to watch for you so please let me know what you think about this week's special doll makeover and also please tell me if you watch the new Wednesday show and if you like this new adaptation I'm really curious to hear what you're gonna say so and if you want to get this doll to your collection please check out my eBay she's there for sale right now for three days the link is in the description box under this video so go there if you are interested so and that was my doll transformation of the week, I really hope you enjoyed it today and if so guys please don't forget to support my art here on YouTube with your likes, of course subscribe to my channel, hit the bell button to get notified about my new doll repaint videos and I will see you very soon, I don't know in a week or in two weeks in a new doll transformation. Have a nice weekend, love you guys, bye!